Devil Daggers is one of the hardest games I've ever played. It's a first person shooter where you try and survive on a platform while swarms of demon spawn rush you. You have one life. A typical run for me is less than 60 seconds. It's crushingly difficult, but oh so brilliant. If Quake and Super Hexagon had a baby, Devil Daggers would be that baby. And the baby would be rock hard. It's fast, and you really need to be fast. Within seconds of starting, your platform will be overtaken if you don't systematically take down groups as they spawn in. They're faster than you, they'll kill you with one touch. Big demon squid things will spawn in new enemies if you don't take them out by shooting their weak point. Collect red crystals that drop from certain enemies and you can upgrade your weapon. And die, almost instantly. Aside from the sublime gameplay, Devil Daggers looks amazing. I absolutely adore the art style. It's got this 32-bit PlayStation 1 era look to it with its blocky meshes and warping textures. Obviously the game does far more with its engine than a PlayStation or Sega Saturn could ever do. They'd just start smoking if they had this many enemies on screen at once. But the low fidelity 3D graphics add to the game's atmosphere and sense of place. Devil Daggers wouldn't be a better game if it ran with sharp photorealistic textures and smooth high polygon models. The weird blocky nature of it all really makes it feel grimier. Devil Daggers isn't for everyone. It's a game for people that like to play the same content over and over to perfect their skills. There's no story and no characters. The only progression in the game is the progression of your skill level as you get better. You'll be a slave to the timed leaderboards, gradually increasing your time from 15 seconds to 20 seconds to 60 seconds and hopefully beyond. It's a simple shooter that is actually anything but simple. <laughs>